earlier what happened the landlords created a stair uh, below them they are called joddar they are they are also landlords and they did not cultivate they give their land for cultivation to the uh, poor peasants small peasants and uh, tenants they give then people which gave the rule was there they will the farmers will cultivate on their own cost but after cultivation that crop will be gathered in the uh, farm of the landlords and there it will be divided and uh, half uh, will be half will be given to the uh, cultivators half will get the landlords joddars that was the system then kisan sabha raised that no we our expenditure is growing we need more share then they said for, uh, crop should be divided in three parts two parts should go to the farmers and one part will go to the landlords and they also started not uh, carrying the crops to the landlords farm but they at the common farm and they decide there and divide and one uh, portion they started giving but farmer landlord didn't agree they attacked it. big attack was there communal attack between muslim were the farmers and hindu were the big landlords in that bangladesh and eastern so because they made a huge communal riots massive communal riot was there in 1946 also here before independence this struggle uh, of tebhaga it is called tebhaga three his parts of the crops one parts will go to the landlord tebhaga is the called that movement 1946 started and then communal riots was organized and massive to divide the movement but ultimately farmers came together and fought against the joddar and their gunda and police when there is a massive attack by the police in 1947 there is a big a tragedy called khanpur in khanpur about 22 farmers were killed in this after that in jalpaiguri in the south chobish pargana farmers were killed total 73 farmers were killed all in the different parts of bangladesh bengal and then this movement spread though this movement did not win because of repression uh, it had to retreat but this movement was wide spread and this identified the enemies and they created consciousness among the farmers that if we unite only we can be able to get our rights so they united more this movement has a big impact in west bengal and also it influenced by spread in bihar uttar pradesh so this adhyar movement is called adhyar means uh, uh, tenants movement a section of the a uh, um, crops uh, should be given to the uh, farmers this movement spread in different parts of the country